Black is the most popular color used when it comes to vinyl wraps. People love these colors for wrapping the entire vehicle. They love it for wrapping just the chrome pieces. Black is really popular. Are there visual differences between 3M and Avery's shades of black vinyl wraps? We're gonna find that out today. So in front of me, I have laid out all six different shades of black. So on the left, we have 3M's gloss black, sand black, and matte black. And on the right, we have Avery's matte black, sand black, and gloss black. We're gonna be comparing the matte versions together, the sand versions together, Together, and of course the gloss versions together. Now I'm fully aware that there's a lot of other vinyl wrap brands out there besides just Avery and 3M. However, these are the two most widely accepted brands and you're gonna find these pretty much at any vinyl wrap shop. So these are the two that we're gonna be focusing on today. So let's look at 3M Avery's matte black. So I have 3M's on the left and Avery on the right. So at a quick glance, there isn't too much of a difference between the two, but I would say Avery's probably looks a little bit more gray than 3M's. As you see right there in the light, it kinda has almost like a really faint brown hue to it. Avery's though, almost looks a little colder, if that makes sense. Whereas the matte black from 3M, it looks a little a little warmer. It's really hard to tell and I have them side by side. So obviously if this was on a car and you don't have another one next to it to you compare it to, you really wouldn't be able to tell the difference. It looks pretty much identical, so you can't really go wrong with either one. Next up, we have the satin blacks. So with the satin blacks, you actually might notice a little bit more of a difference. Uh, from what we've noticed from installing both of these films is that Avery's satin black looks a little bit more black, a little darker than 3M satin black. And you might be able to tell just from this right here, it has more of a sheen to it. It looks a little bit darker, whereas this looks a little bit grayer. Avery's has a little bit more of a shine to it. I'd say this leans towards more of a gloss, whereas this leans more towards the matte. This looks a little grayer when it's actually installed. So in my opinion, this is more of a truer satin black than 3M's satin black. Last but not least, the gloss blacks. The gloss blacks are very similar to the matte version in the way that there isn't too much of a difference between the two. And they also have a lot of this ripply texture to them. Do you guys see that in the light? How it looks really ripply? This is called orange peel because it kind of reminds you of an orange peel. It doesn't seem like a big deal on a sample sheet like this that's this small. On a full car, it's a lot more obvious and it doesn't look really good. It looks like a really bad paint job. However, with that being said, I know we said that we will only talk about 3M Avery, but there is a third film I want to show you guys. And it's it's this one, the nose of text gloss black. So right off the bat, you might notice something really different about this. Let me bring back in the other two so you can see. Do you guys see a difference between this gloss black and the two that we just looked at? It is a lot clearer looking. So I'll just pull this next to the Avery. Can you guys see just the difference in clarity? Look at the light bar up top. Just see how the reflection looks off of Avery's and look at how it looks off of Inositech's gloss black. So Inositech is an up and coming vinyl wrap company that we've discovered. They specialize in colors you would mainly find on like exotic cars. However, they did come out with this gloss black and I mean, you can just see right off the bat, it looks amazing. Clarity is unreal. It looks so much clearer than Avery. And here's 3M, just compare crazy haziness. I mean, here's the reflection of me. I mean, just, it's a huge difference, right? You guys can see, super hazy, super textury on the left and it's a lot clearer on the right. Oh, and by the way, actually, there's something really cool about this. This is actually not even the film itself. This is actually a top layer. So what that means is this actually looks even clearer than what you just saw. I should have pulled it off earlier, but I wanted to do this because I'd be kind of cool. Like, whoa, oh my God, it's even clearer. So this is the actual vinyl wrap film. Look how clear this is. Out of all the vinyl wraps that we've ever seen, this looks the most like paint. And that's what you want to go for. Look at the light bar up top. Look how much clearer that looks compared to 3M's. Isn't that a nine day difference? And here it is with Avery. I mean, it's crazy. So if you're looking for gloss black, definitely, definitely recommend Inositech if you want to go for the best. Otherwise, if your local vinyl wrap shop doesn't have this, then either the Avery or the 3M will work. They both are pretty much identical. But I do know that after seeing this though, it's kind of hard to choose between these two. So hopefully this video helps gives you a little bit more of an insight between the two brands and their different shades of black. I know it's a lot harder to compare them when you're looking online and you're seeing one picture of, you know, 3M's gloss black versus Avery's gloss black 
black and they're like from two different people, from two different light sources and they could be altered or filtered. So it's hard to tell, but hopefully the fact that I have all of them laid out here under the same lighting side by side, it gives you a better idea of what to expect. Best thing to do is to see these in person. That way you can judge which one you like more. Now two things that people might wonder about are the thickness between the two brands or how easy are they to install. As far as thickness goes, between the two brands, they're pretty much the same. Any difference is negligible. I mean, they're not gonna protect your paint like a clear bra would. So if you're looking for some sort of like physical protection, then you wanna look into a clear bra and not a vinyl wrap. And I made a video about that a while ago. So if you guys wanna see that, just check out the channel. And as far as installation goes, I mean, it's all personal preference. I have installers that prefer 3M. I've had installers that prefer Avery. I would say if you're looking to get your car wrapped or chrome deleted, ask the shop that you're gonna have work on your car and just have them pick whichever one they're more comfortable with. But that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you found this somewhat helpful. If you have any questions or you want me to cover some topics that I didn't cover, let me know in the comments below. And if you haven't yet, hit the subscribe button and I will see you guys next time.